This book, 1001 Comics You Must Read Before You Die, opened my mind to comics from all over the world and a rich history that goes back over 120 years. This video series highlights some of my favorites. Here you go. Little Orphan Annie is one of the earliest comic strips and it's one of the few that is still remembered very fondly today. Although it's not really remembered as a comic strip, it's better known as a stage play or the movie from the 80s. You're singing that song in your head right now, aren't you? But the comic strip is where it all started back in 1924. It was the story of this little redhead girl who was an orphan and just kind of bounced around from place to place, not really having a constant home or a family that she can call her own. Now, she did have uh, Daddy Warbucks, who was kind of her adoptive father, but through a series of events, she was often sent away or lost, or Daddy Warbucks was lost, and she just kind of fell upon hardship after hardship. But the thing that makes this comic strip so uniquely Little Orphan Annie is because of her always optimistic, spunky attitude. And this started in the 20s and went through the Great Depression, and it was a positive way for people to cope with the realities of the day. Little Orphan Annie was a strip that people tuned into every single day and followed for many, many years. Now, Harold Gray's political views are not for everybody. He was pretty conservative and definitely a capitalist, and that would come out from time to time in the stories, but other than that, the strip adventures themselves, just fantastic. Really, really great storytelling. This first volume, it's a little slow to start, but once you get into the subsequent volumes, they just hook you right in there. The Library of American Comics started reprinting Little Orphan Annie in 2008, starting from the beginning in 1924, and they've made it all the way to 1953, so there is plenty of Annie for you to find. However, these books, especially the earlier ones being so old, are falling out of print, so jump on them while you can if you see them for a good deal. This is Little Orphan Annie by Harold Gray.